producer and my husband, Todd Hughes. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. 
uh, there was nothing that could have stopped me to put the brakes on anything uh, and changed my path because in my mind I was going to do it the way I wanted to do it. And uh, when there was so much uh, being so out of control of my surroundings and the chaos at the time, I was important to control myself and my decisions and taking drugs was something I was going to do and do it to its fullest. And um, so yeah, it took what it took to get me clean so can I ask a question? Yeah. Okay. So, <laughs> oh, I, I have Francis. Yeah. So, you know, Bonnie Moore, I just did a record with him. Yeah. And he's still a Nazi. Yeah. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> another drummer. Yeah. Yeah. He took another drummer. But, I mean, do you think it's generational that we didn't know? Because I remember, right. I was watching this and I was, it happens later, but right. I was right. well, over well, a soda. Well, but, it, I'm just wondering, you think it's the Gen X thing of like, you know, we're a family, we're a family. But what I was saying to you was, I found out later that like all these rock records from, it would be after, before people replace people. Right. Duff McGinnis. Is that Duff McGinnis? Yeah, I found the same thing. I discovered the same thing. And do you think you would have gone so, you know, with Gregory? <laughs> <laughs> you know, if I would have known, you know, I still would have taken it hard, but um, yeah, I, the, the, it was sort of, I didn't really know that that kind of stuff went on. I know it was kind I of naive. I didn't either. That but also, scary. I think that we became so corporate. You like, we eventually became. But you know, that's, what, that's what made the night special. Is family now when there are no more tickets to Madison Square Gardens? I mean, that's what Billy Joe Armstrong said to me. Right? He's a punker. I don't know. Any, any more questions from the band at the group? <laughs> <laughs> I just want to say, um, we saw you guys at Roseland um, for the Celebrity Skin Tour. It was so cool Woo! to see that little fat. My boyfriend and I have been together for 13 years, and it was just like the best night of my life. And it's kind of fun that we're here for this. Yeah, right there. What you're doing next? Like your oh, um, individually? Sure. Oh, I'm together. <laughs> because it's really not about a band called The Hole at all. It really is entirely about Patty. And Absolutely. the only reason I came to this movie theater is that Patty Schemmel is alive. The <laughs> only I do want to say that, you know, if something's not relevant, I, I don't want to do it. So for me, you know, as much as I love Playing with Patty, I would play with her in five seconds again, and, and everyone's standing on the stage. If it's not moving forward, I don't want to do it. That's just my thing. So, <laughs> 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 you know, so I'm going to end the Rolling Stones. So this ball was bloody Rollins. You know, it's, it's, if it's not miserable and it's going forward, then I'm happy with it. That's all I have to say about that question. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks to you guys. Thank you.